Hey guys, Caleb here. Thanks for checking out the video. Today we're going to be talking about um, setting lighting cues in ProPresenter, which then send a MIDI signal to our light board to change lighting scenes uh, for songs, message time, announcements, things like that. So I'm going to show you how to set the lighting cue, um, how to edit a lighting cue, and then I'll show you just how easy it works. Okay, so here we are in ProPresenter. And uh, basically, you can see this little um, icon right here. That is basically just a communication icon or a MIDI icon. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and remove that, and I'll show you how to put it on there, uh, and then um, how to edit it. So we have this nifty little sheet here that I made that gives us all the lighting cues um, that we have set in the lighting board already. And then each, oops, each of those has... Um, the different notes that correspond um, which you'll be able to see here in a little bit so in order to set a lighting cue we usually set them on the background for each song that way when the background changes so does the lighting scene um, so you go to the background slide you right click it okay and then I want you to take this guy down to add action and you go over until you find communication and you want to click on this right here. It's MIDI note on. And this gives you this option. So device should always be MIDI and the command should always be MIDI note on. I don't think that'll ever not be, but if you ever for some reason do this and that's not that ca the case, you need to make sure these are right. Channel will always be one, same thing. And then the note is where this sheet comes into play. So let's say I want to set it for all blue. That would be E-2, which is number four. So, I go down to E-2, and then I set my intensity all the way down for 127. So, now that that's set, um, I'll move you up here just a little bit. You can kind of see a little bit there. When I click on this slide, it then sends that MIDI over to the light board, and you can see the lights changed a little bit. So, that's how it works. That's how you set it up. Now let's look at how to edit it. Right click this again, and instead of add action, you're gonna go down to edit actions, and you're gonna select MIDI note on, and then this just pops up again. And then all you have to do is change it to something else. So let's say I wanna set it to purple. It's F sharp two, number six. I can leave intensity at 127, click away, and click on the slide again and you can see the lights change. It's that easy, guys. If you have any questions, um, let me know, and I would be happy to help you out. Thanks.